welcome to Storytime. My name is Liz and thank you for joining me today wherever you are in the world. Now today I've chosen a story all about an owl who's going back to school. Because I thought, hmm, lots of my friends are telling me that they're going back to school or they're going back to nursery. And we've had a bit of time off recently, haven't we? So it can feel a bit scary, a bit daunting about going back to school. So I thought, hmm, let's find out how Al felt when he went to school. So here's the book we're going to read. Oh, do you recognise some of these characters? Yeah, we've read them before, haven't we? It's one of my colourful books. Can you remember the names? Who's this? Yeah, you're absolutely right. It's Meg. Meg is a witch who likes to cast spells, although they don't always go the way that she wants, do they? And we've got her cat, and the cat's name is Mog. That's right, and Mog is very stripy. And their friend is Owl. And you can't see Owl's beak at the moment because he's got a scarf wrapped around him. So it must be cold. So normally we put a scarf, we wrap a scarf around us when we're feeling a bit chilly. And it looks like Meg is giving Owl a little red suitcase. Not too sure why. Maybe we'll find out in the story. And the title of this book is Owl at School. And I love the colours used in the Meg and Mog collection. And the way they draw the pictures. They're very graphic and they have a different perspective on, um, on the pictures. So let's start the story, shall we? Here we go. Owl is flying and then crunch. Oops. Oh dear, I was crashed into a tree. He'll have to go to school. Crushed again, said Mog. Meg said, come on, you'll love it. Here is your dinner. Oh, so it was a lunchbox, not a suitcase as I thought. Wrap up warm. Hurry, we'll be late. Meg took Owl to school. Bye, be good. Are you new? Hello, Snowy. There were all the different owls in the tree. There were four other owls in the class. There was Big Ears, Tawny, Barney and Titch. And Titch said, you can sit next to me. The teacher was called Mr Winko. I'm sure you'll be very happy here, he said. The first lesson was swooping and pouncing. Whoosh! Mr Winko said, now don't all pounce at once. I'm trying to pounce on the mouse. Attack! between the branches. Owl was topping soaring, middling at hovering, good at diving and bottom in swimming. It was sports night. Owl was anxious. At home Meg was making a special hat. La di di, la di da, fling it together and there you are. Meg brought Mog to watch the school sports. Good luck, Al, said Mog. Mr Winko was looking at Meg's hat. Oh, charming, absolutely charming. Everybody noticed Meg's hat. They were so busy looking at Meg's hat that, way, Al, yay, won the night flight race. Hooray, said the bat. Al asked all his friends to tea. Mouse Jelly, can I come tomorrow? I won, said Al. Show off, said Mog. After tea, they all went home. Goodbye, Snowy. Goodbye. Oh. So Al had a really good time at school. Some things he did really well in, some things he did okay in, and some things he didn't do so well in. But he still enjoyed himself and that's really important. Thank you for listening to my story and I'll see you really soon.
But until then, remember, stay safe, keep washing your hands and count to 20 and keep smiling. Bye for now. Bye.